We better get going. Apple Valley, here we come. Hey, it's a goat. He sure is cute. It says Apple Valley, 157 miles. Wow, that's pretty far. I'm going to be late if that old goat doesn't ski that hole pretty quick. Shay, I don't believe we've met. The name's Cassidy. Roll along, Cassidy. Glad to meet you. I'm Putt-Putt. Well, howdy, Putt-Putt. Say, would you be able to find something to move this goat off the track? He looks hungry to me. Okay, I'll see what I can do. flowers might come in handy. I think I'll hold on to them. <laughs> Here, Goaty Goaty. Here, Goat. That did the trick. Well, thanks, partner. I've been trying to get that gall darn goat to move all morning. I'm going to be late for the circus if I don't get my old caboose moving. You're going to the circus too? Wow, so are we. Well, uh, technically speaking, I'm uh, delivering stuff to the circus. Sawdust. Tons and tons of sawdust. Oh, no. There goes my ticket to the circus. I don't have any money for a new one. Now what am I going to do? You're going to hop right on my freight car. I'm taking you straight to the Big Top Circus in Apple Valley, Putt-Putt. I'm sure we can figure out a way to get you into that circus, ticket or no ticket. Gee, thanks, Cassidy. Did you hear that, Pep? We're getting a train ride to the circus. Hot ziggity! This is great! Wow! I can't believe I'm at the circus! Yep. BJ Sweeney's genuine big top circus. And BJ's just the one you need to talk to about your little ticket problem. BJ Sweeney the ringmaster? Wow! Where do I find him? Right next to the gate, my friend. I'm sure he'd be happier than a hen to help you out. I sure hope so. Well, thanks again for the ride, Cassidy. Well, we must go through about 15 tons of this here sawdust every year. Well, the animals use it for everything from their beds to their bathroom. Oh, my goodness! <laughs> See you later, Cassidy! Best of luck to you, my friend. <laughs> oh my goodness! You must be BJ Sweeney, the most famous ringmaster in the world! You don't look too happy! Of course I'm not happy! I have a really big show to put on tonight! A spectacular spectacle meant to curl your tailpipe and put a spin in your tires! But I'm afraid the show can't go on! <laughs> Why not? Because everything's a jumbled mess! 
When we pulled in here, nothing got put in the right place. Oh, my five main acts are crying mutiny, and the other acts are having problems too. Here are the five main acts. Honko the Clown, the Flying Porkowskis, Philippe the Flea, Reginald the Lion, and Katie Cannonball. This circus is doomed. Maybe I can help you. By the way, my name's Putt-Putt. Thanks, Putt-Putt. Here, take this. Maybe it will help. Don't worry about a thing, Mr. BJ Sweeney. I'll do my best to make sure everything is A-OK. -okay. If you help me get this circus up and running, you'll have free circus tickets for life. That's great, since, uh, a goat kind of ate my ticket. It says BJ Sweeney's Big Top Circus. That's where the circus is going to be. Kairos, a complete breakfast now with added vitamin G for that great gasoline get up and go. Wow, I'm actually inside the Big Top. I should take a look around. Whoa! Has the circus started already? No, I'm early. I'm helping Mr. Sweeney to get his axe ready for the show. Hey, I could use some help. Big time. I'm Lester. Pleased to meet you. I'm Putt-Putt. What's the problem? My boss, Philippe. Philippe the Flea. He has fled with his fellow flea followers to where I do not know. He's a tad upset about the condition of his small umbrella tent here. As you can see, it's a mess. Maybe I can find him for you. Well, then you're going to need this. And see if you can find him a new tent while you're at it. Thanks, Lester. Get your peanuts! Get your fresh, hot, roasted peanuts! Mmm! That sounds good. How much are you selling your peanuts for? Usually these peanuts sell for, uh, peanuts. Less than a nickel. But today, because it's opening night, I'm giving them away. If you take on the peanut challenge and win. The peanut challenge? What's that? Yeah, t take a closer look at my peanut gallery and I'll explain. Okay, here's how the game works. You got ten peanuts in your pile to toss to those hungry tin cars. If you can feed three cars, you will win your own jumbo bag of fresh, hot, roasted peanuts. On your mark, get set, throw! You did it! You won the peanut challenge! And for that astounding win, you get one jumbo bag of fresh hot roasted peanuts absolutely free from me, bought the peanut cut, home of the peanut challenge. One bag per customer. <laughs> Wow, thanks a lot. Hey, what are you going to do now that you won them? Gobble them up in seconds flat? No, I'm not hungry right now. I think I'll save them for later. That's a very wise decision. You might find someone you want to share them with. That's a huge target. I wonder what that big target's used for. When the circus comes to your town We start setting off the tent Cleaning up and getting ready for the show The big show! As the audience rolls in We see all the children grin Looking forward to pink lemonade And popcorn, don't you know? Under, Under the, the big, big, big top We have big, big fun Under, Under the, the big spotlight There are smiles for everyone You'll see stunt cars doing wheelies If you get to join the show And giraffes that jump through giant hoops There are Pair of alligators, two fancy roller skaters, and a monkey on a motorbike. The triple loop de loop. Under, Under the, the big, big, big top, we have big, big, big fun. Under, Under the, the big, big spotlights, there are smiles for everyone. When the show is finally over and the tents are taken down, the trucks and trays will take us places far and near. To 
other towns where cars are waiting For the fun we'll be creating But we're coming back to do it all again Next year Under the big, big top We a big, big fun Under the big spotlight There are smiles for everyone If you get to join the circus You'll never want the show to stop Underneath the big, 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 big top Underneath the big, 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 big top <laughs> Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. Are you a real police car? Uh, hello, Putt-Putt. The name's Hank. I was a police car. Now I'm working as a security guard, guarding the circus. Wow! That must be exciting. It has its good days. Sorry, you can't go back there. Or over there, for that matter. Why not? You need security clearance. Can't let just anybody backstage, you know. How do I get security clearance? Take this backstage security pass and get it authorized and signed off in triplicate by the proper authorities. Who are the proper authorities? I'm not sure, but I'll know it when I see it. All I do know is that it has to be proper. Okay, I'll see what I can do. The tent is closed. I wonder what's inside. Open sesame! Excuse me, Mr. Sweeney. Hank the security car said I needed an authorized signature in triplicate before he'd let me go backstage. Can you do that? Of course I can. Good to see he's doing his job. Ah, that's my life. Paperwork. Here you go. Your backstage security clearance. Thanks. Here we go, Pep! I'm telling you, Reggie, it doesn't look bad. Not bad at all. This new costume looks ridiculous. It's... it's undignified. You, Reggie, could never in a million years look undignified. No way, no how, Reggie. Honest! What do you think about this travesty of a costume? It, uh, looks like you're ready to go swimming. Swimming? No, of course. It's a bathing suit. Why, it's a mistake. This is coming off immediately. Good riddance. Yeah, do you have any need for this? Sure, it might come in handy. And maybe I can find your costume for you. Oh, thank goodness. Mine is a regal costume, fit for a king. Pardon me, but I don't believe you've had the pleasure. I'm Reginald Cornelius Andronicles the Third, And these are my assistants, Terry and Marie. Tom, a pleasure. I'm Putt-Putt. Thank you for doing this, Putt-Putt. I need that costume for tonight. Yeah, without it, the show won't go on. Those are monkeys. Monkeys are silly. That's a show horse. Horses like carrots. That's a camel. They can go a long time without water. Those are giraffes. They have long necks so they can eat leaves out of trees. At the drum, the tropics, 
the big, big cafe. I worked with the fruit cart. Now I've learned acrobatic art. Across the desert, dry and sunny. Could I please have some cotton candy? We used to roam the Serengeti. I very feel like some spaghetti. Come on, you two, let's sing now and eat later. Okay, everybody. The circus, the circus, where the animals in the circus. We see country town and city lights. A different audience every night. We might be tall or slightly tiny. We keep our costumes bright and shiny. The circus, the circus, where the animals in the circus. We get to jump in front. And our night place to sleep. And plenty to eat. But when the show is done. In the circus, the circus, where the animals in the circus. The circus, the circus, where the animals in the circus. This must be where they do all the construction for the circus. I'm Sebastian, the juggling seal. Wait, I think I've got it this time. Not again. Wow, that looks difficult. Believe it or not, right now it's harder than it looks keeping this ball in the air. Usually, I have four juggling clubs. But I do what I can, it's all I can do. Hey, if I make a fool out of myself tonight, they'll just have me perform with the clowns. Could be worse. If you want me to, I could keep on the lookout for your other juggling club. Oh, I like the way you think. That would be splendiferous. You'd be doing old Sebastian the Juggling Seal a whale of a favor. That will work. Oh, hello. You come to watch Bill O'Brodnick dance? He's wild and crazy. It sure is. Oh, you take break, guys, okay? Who are you talking to? Oh, bunch of fleas. Into my fur they moved and now they are disco dancing just like Bill O'Brodnick. Wow. Mr. Sweeney said that Philippe the Flea from his flea act needed some help. Hey, I have an idea. Maybe Philippe is in your fur. I could find him and talk to him. Good. And help I could use too. Now these fleas are very nice and polite bunch, but between you and me they are a little itchy. And they make me dance this crazy disco. I need to practice my act for Big Top tonight. Well, you know what? I have the perfect thing I can use to see them and find Philippe if he's in there. Oh, very good. Putt-Putt? Baby Jumbo? How come you're not in the Cartown Zoo? I'm traveling with the circus this summer. And guess what? I'm not a scaredy elephant anymore. That's great. I learned how to paint pictures all by myself. What do you think, Putt-Putt? They're really good pictures, Baby Jumbo. My mama says I have talent. I can even paint you if you want. Oh, that would be fun. Lemon yellow. Here it comes. I hope this looks good. It'll look great. I'm an artist, you know. That's it, Putt-Putt. Great. Thanks, Baby Jumbo. Okay. Orangey orange is on its way. Hope I like this. Oh, you will. You're all done. Thanks, Baby Jumbo. Grassy green. Here goes. Oh, boy. This is gonna look great. All done. Wowie zowie, that's great. 
Blueberry Red coming up. I think I'm gonna like this. I know you will. That's it, Putt-Putt. Thanks. Hmm, what's this? Hey, it looks like half of a recipe. I think I'll hang on to it. Get ready for Blueberry Blue. Wowie zowie, this is fun. It sure is. All done. Gee, thanks. Look at that. BJ Sweeney's signature. Can't get any more proper than that. Go right in anytime you want to. Gee, thanks. Say there, catnip. Here's a joke coming at you. Okay, hit me, Ratto. <laughs> Nah, I meant with a joke. Sheesh, you're always clowning around. Hey, it's my job. Why did the ringmaster have two sons and name them both Ed? Golly, I don't know. Because two Eds are better than one. <laughs> oh, you're a clown, Ratto. An umbrella. This doesn't belong here. I should find who it belongs to and return it to them. Wow! That must be Honko the Clown! Hi, Honko! I wonder what he's trying to say. the clown. Wow! The clowns must use this for putting their costumes together. Noses. Ears. That's silly. Hey, a trampoline! I think I'll hold on to this. It might be useful. Wow, that trailer must belong to Pectoral the Strong Van. Maybe he got so strong because he eats all those fruits and vegetables. Look, a juicer. If I put some vegetables in it, I can make a vegetable shake. Spinach. Spinach. Apples. Pears. Pictorial the Strong Van. Hi, I'm Putt 
Bigfoot. Good evening. I am Marvin the Marvelous. Prepare to be astounded by an amazing card trick that will leave you spellbound. Wait a minute, it's not showtime. What am I thinking? Besides, I can't even do my card tricks. My magic cards are a mess. Can you fix them? I tried. I waved my wand over the whole catastrophe and even magic didn't help. Everything is supposed to be in pairs, but the cards are still all messed up. Maybe I can help. That, my friend, would be simply marvelous. <laughs> I wonder which cards match up. A rabbit. Juggling ball. No, those don't match. A magician's hat. A juggling club. A star. A rabbit. A rabbit. A rabbit. It's a match. A star. Juggling ball. Juggling ball. Juggling ball. A star. A star. A magician's hat. A magician's hat. That's funny. There's no match for this one. I'd better tell Marvin about that. I'm all done. But this card was left over, Marvin. It didn't have a match. Ah, the juggling club. The match for that card got lost when we were playing Peoria. That, my friend, is all yours if you'd like it. Gee, thanks. Ah, uh -uh. not so fast. You deserve much more than a mere card. After all, you saved my show. Mambo Jumbo, Hocus Pocus, Dominocus. A chicken? No, oh, that's not right. Let's see. Abracadabra, Hocus Pocus, Dillyocus. <laughs> There we go. I thought I'd lost my touch. A genuine juggling club. All for you. Wowie zowie. Thanks. Sebastian, one juggling club. Splendiferous. It looks just like old Sebastian the Juggling Seal's Juggling Club. Woohoo! That is great! Here, have a ball. Gee, thanks. No, gee, thanks to you. Woohoo! You did me a great favor. I'm a fantastic juggling genius once again. Arr. I can't use that there. That won't do me any good there. Mr. Sweeney with Honka the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, the Flying Porkowski's Trapeze Act, Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act, and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. Oh, 
Okay, Bella Brodnik, let me see if I can find Philippe. Best of luck to you. Whoa! Look at all those fleas! I wonder where Philippe is. I need to find him. You have come to ask me to return to my ring in the big top? But sadly, I cannot. You see my tent? It is falling apart. Circus star like myself simply cannot work in such an inferior place. Oh, I promised Lester I would find a new tent for you, so everything's gonna be okay. So you and your fleet troop can come with me, and after I find your new tent, I'll take you back to the big top. This is such a kind offer, Putt Putt. I would gladly accept, but we can only travel in style. We would need something warm, something furry, something... Oh, magnifique! I have spotted the perfect creature! Come on, everybody! It's okay, Pep. It's just for a little while. And they're very nice fleas. Oh, goodness me. Milo Brodnik says thank you very much. Now I can dance to my own beat and practice my dancing for Big Top Show tonight. Found Philippe? I have, Lester. He and his flea friends are keeping my dog Pep company. Oh, what a relief. Now, as soon as you track down a new tent, I'll bet my broom he'll want to move right in. I could get Honko's attention. Maybe I should hold on to this ball until I can understand Honko. I need to find a way to understand Honko. He sounds like he wants something, but I don't know what it is. I should find a way to figure out what he's saying. I don't think that will work. That looks just like Mama Mobasa from the Cartown Zoo. I wonder if it is. Mama Mobasa, is that you? She sure is sleeping soundly. I wonder why she is at the circus. If I could wake her up, I could ask. I think I have something I can use to wake up Mama Mobasa. 
Look what I have. Fresh hot roasted peanut. Peanuts? Am I still dreaming? This is wonderful. Why, I can't believe my old elephant eyes. Is that really you, Putt-Putt? It sure is, Mama Mubasa. Honey, it is so good to see you. Baby Jumbo and I are working with the circus this summer, and my sweet boy is having the time of his life. I already saw him, Mama Mubasa. Oh, you did? Did you see his wonderful paintings? I sure did. They were great. That's my boy. Such an imagination. I borrowed that net from someone, but I don't remember who. I can return that for you, Mama Mubasa. BJ Sweeney asked me to help out with the circus. Must be where Mr. Sweeney keeps all the tools to fix things for his big top circus. Hmm, I wonder what this is. This must be the other half of the recipe I found. Wow, I'd better hang on to it. Hmm, I wonder what this recipe makes. Pectoral the Strong Band Secret Recipe. I wonder what it could be. I bet Mr. Sweeney would mind if I borrowed this saw. It might be good for fixing things around the circus. As long as I'm very careful with it. Looks like the perfect place to make that power shake recipe I found. This is the place to make the power shake, all right. Hmm. Now, what is it supposed to have in it again? Pectoral the Strong Band secret recipe. Celery, beets, and asparagus. Celery. Beets. Asparagus. All full. Wow, this is a powerful drink. I think I'll save the rest for later. Use that there. Don't tell me Mr. BJ Sweeney sent you to talk us into performing without a safety net. Tell him the flying Porkowskis won't do it. We refuse to fly through the air on the trapeze with the greatest of ease if we don't have a safety net. Won't do it. No way. And that's final. I wouldn't either. That would be dangerous. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. And actually, Mr. Sweeney wanted me to help you. So where is your safety net anyway? That's the problem. Can't find it anywhere. It's been missing since we got here. Wait a minute. I might just have what you're looking for. I'll believe it when pigs can fly. We can fly, Paul. Well, sort of hammy. A bunch and a heat, Putt-Putt. You're welcome. Now you can be safe. The flying Porkowski can fly again. Come on, Paul. 
I want to practice my flying upside down trick. Okay, Hammy, we're coming. I do hope you'll come see us in the show, Putt Putt. Oh, I will. I want to see Hammy do that upside down trick. It is a sight. Well, better start practicing. Oh boy, I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honka the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act, and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. I am Buzzsaw. I can cut anything with my sharp blade. Pick a shape to cut. Hmm, that machine doesn't seem to have a saw in it. I know, maybe the saw I found in the tool shed would work. Great, now Buzz can cut wood for fixing things around the circus. Triangle. That's great! This platform goes all the way up to the high wire. I wonder what's up there. Here I go. Hi, I'm Putt Putt. Do you need some help? The name's Eunice. And do I ever! I am having the toughest time trying to balance on this practice wire. Never happened before! I am baffled! I can tell you that! I might have something you can use to help you balance, Eunice. Well, this is my lucky day, isn't it? Can't wait to see what it is! I can't use that there. <laughs> Here, do you think this big umbrella will help? You never know. Can you hand it over? Sorry, I can't reach that far. Guess you're gonna have to come around the other way. Okay, I can do that. I think... Hey, Eunice, what's that wrench for? It tightens that loose wire. I've been trying to fix it all morning. But as they say, it takes two to tighten. I think the bolt's a little rusty. Maybe I can figure out how to get over there, and then I can help you tighten it. You're on! <laughs> I hope you don't think it's too bold of me to ask, but do you know a little something about music? Me? 
Maybe a little bit. Why? See, I'm the circus orchestra, the circus conductor, and the circus accompaniment all rolled into one. And I've got a couple of teensy little problems. My pipes are all mixed up, and it seems like I have some old translation book stuck in them. I figure if someone can set my pipes right, I can get up enough steam to get that book out. I can help you with that. Oh, that is music to my ears. Now the key here is to arrange my pipes from the lowest note to the highest note. Okay, I'll try it. By the way, since you're being so helpful and all, I should introduce myself. I'm Bet Bandwagon. I'm Putt-Putt. Well, Putt-Putt, glad to meet you. Okay, remember, arrange my pipes so they go from the lowest sounding note to the highest sounding note. The green light means that the pipe is in the correct spot. The red light means that the pipe is in the wrong spot. I think that most of the pipes are already in the right spot. Bet. Okay, here goes. That was music to my ears. My goodness, it's the honkish translation book. Well, however did that get caught in my pipes? A honkish translation book? I could use that to talk to Honko the Clown. Oh, you most certainly could. Here, you take it, Putt Putt, and thanks. You are my musical maestro. Thanks, Bet. This is great. So are you, Putt Putt. So are you. Thank you again, Maestro, for fixing my pipes. You're welcome, Bet. How about a little song? Sure. The Song of the Elephants. The elephants, the large and Oh, I hope you come to help. I have. I'm Putt-Putt. Mr. Sweeney asked me to help out. Oh, Putt-Putt. Hello, I'm Katie Cannonball. And I'm just having the hardest old time remembering how to set my little cannon here. I fly out of it in the show, but if it's not set right, oh, there's no telling where I'd wind up. Maybe even the moon. How do you usually set it up? Usually, I have my cannon plan. You know, a little blueprint. It shows how to set my cannon, but they seem to be missing. Do you think you could help me find them? Sure, no problem. Oh, good. Meanwhile, I'll just fiddle around with this thing. I don't want to waste any water. Phew! This suit is getting tight! Hey, that's Francine, the famous hippo high diver! Hi, I'm Putt-Putt! What are you doing way up there? Practicing my dives! Or at least my form! The pool is dry as the desert, so I can't jump! Why don't you put some water in it? I suspect it wouldn't do a lick of good! There's a hole the size of Apple Valley in there! It's a hole in the shape of a square. Maybe I can fix it for you. If you do that, Putt-Putt, you'll be my hero. I'm raring to go here. I think 
I should recycle this wood. We don't want it to go to waste. Square. Hmm. I think the hole in the pool is in the shape of a square. Oh boy. is in the shape of a square. That's it! Hey, you patched the pool! I sure did! Fantastic! See, why don't you fill her up with water? Then I can practice my dive! You got it! <laughs> Okay, pool looks full to me. Ooh, I can't wait to show off some of my fancy dives. And I can't wait to see them. Ready for a little grace in action? Look at me! Pet, by any chance, did you find me a bigger suit? I sure did! I had a feeling you would. Can't wait to change out of this dinky little thing. Excuse me, Francine? Is this yours? Well, glory be! I believe it is! No wonder this other suit is so tight. Excellent! You are a life saver. Here, I won't be needing this. Thanks. Reginald the Lion will sure be happy to get this back. I wonder how I can get to the other side. Wait a minute. Maybe I have something that will help. I think this trampoline will do the trick. Here goes nothing. Excuse me. Yes? Do you work here? I do. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. I'm Ivan. The semi-strong van. Although right now, I am not very strong at all. Why not? What's the matter? I can't find Pectoral's secret power shake recipe. Pectoral the strong van? Pectoral, the original strong van. When he retired, he gave me his secret recipe. And now, it's missing. Without Pectoral's power shake, I am just a 98 pound weakling. So that's what the power shake is for. I already found the recipe and I whipped one up. Pectoral's secret power shake? You have it? I sure do. Would you like it? That is an offer I can't refuse. Here you go, Ivan. Pectoral's secret power shake. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Come to Papa. Now I feel strong! Wowie zowie! That power shake is really powerful! Okay, watch this! That is great! Lifting a ton is easy with Pectoral's secret power shake recipe. Especially for a semi-strong van like me. 
Now I could do this all day, all night. Great, I got him! The plans for Katie Cannonball Cannon Act! She'll sure be happy to see these! Umbrella Eunice, well, let's see if that works. Here, you hold this little fella. <gasps> That's what the problem was. Now that I think about it, that other umbrella looks awfully tiny. This is the umbrella I use in my act. I see that now. Thank you. You're welcome. What do you want me to do with this other umbrella? Keep it. I have no need for it. I can tell you that. Thanks! Well, as I always say, if at first you don't succeed, try a new umbrella! Okay, ready when you are! I think we've got it! Great! Now if you want, you can drive across the high wire! That's what the second wire's for! It's for you four-wheelers! Me, I only need one! Gee, thanks! <laughs> Eunice, do you mind if I drive across the wire? Just come on through when you're ready! Whoa. I sure am high up! Wowie zowie! Here's your costume, Reginald. Thank you. Now, if you'll excuse me, Reginald Cornelius Andronicles the Third can go on the stage again. There's no time to waste. We have a rehearsal to attend. Thank you, Putt Putt. Yeah, you're a real pal. See you at the show. You got it. Great. I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honko the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. Here, Lester. Will this work for the flea tent? Will it ever? Put it in place and we are in business. Oh, now that is a work of art. Philippe is gonna love it. I love it! It's even better than my first paper umbrella tent. It's magnifique! You, Putt Putt, are a star of a car. Ha <laughs> ha! I can perform now! If you'll excuse me, I need to get ready. Sure, see you later. Philippe is coming! I am ready for my makeup! This is great! I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honko the Clown and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night.
translation book will be perfect for talking to Honko the Clown. <laughs> huh. I wonder what he's trying to say. Let me see. Your suspenders ate scrambled eggs. I didn't think that sounded right. You missed taking a bath in bear hair. I didn't think that sounded right either. Wait a minute. I bet this is it. You're missing your nose. Well, that's it. And I just might have something that will work. Here you go, Honko. It's a little red ball. Will this do the trick? You're welcome, Honko. I was happy to help. See you in the big top. Wowie zowie. I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. Cannon, Katie Cannonball. I hardly know how to thank you, Putt Putt. Uh, just say thank you. Oh, thank you. Can you help me set the cannon up? Normally, I have Ivan help me out, but he's busy getting ready for tonight. I'd be happy to help you with that. Really? Oh, I am tickled. Thank you. The controls are right over there. It looks like the controls have a lock on them, probably for safety reasons. One, two, three, four. One, two. One, two, three, four. Five. Green. I hope this works. Okay, Putt-Putt, let's see how it goes. Ta-da! Perfection, Putt-Putt. Bravo! We did it! No, you did it, Putt-Putt. I don't know what I would have done without you. Well, I'd better head for the big top. I don't want to be late. I need to have plenty of time to practice my cannon act. I've got a show to put on. I'll be looking for you, Putt-Putt. See you, Katie Cannonball. Gee, I just got a kiss from a real circus star. Wow! Now all the main acts are ready. Hot ziggity. Mr. B.J. Sweeney's Big Top Circus is all set to open. Welcome, one and all, to the opening night of the Big Top Circus. We have a really big show tonight, and we couldn't have done it without the help of a very special guest, Putt-Putt. Gee, thanks. As a special thank you for all he's done for this circus, we're going to let Putt-Putt perform under the Big Top. Pick your pleasure, Putt-Putt. When you're done, just come up and push this button to start the rest of the show. Wow, which one should I do?
remember, you can perform in another terrific circus act. Or if you're ready to start the big show, just press the red button. Wow, which one should I do? Thank you. 